Okay, after that last video, trying to really combat everything so my opening repertoire is still alright, but here I'm gonna really find the way forward and I came to Epiphany here. C1, F4, A, B8, and uh, actually I was just broad stroking everything and playing uh, Bishop D7. But uh, what we can really see is instead of Bishop D7 here, we could play here. Um, uh, move 10. Uh, instead of that, we play Bishop. We, we play D6. So we have here, here, here going in for the poison pawn. And then we play Queen B6 defending it. And the reason is if they play A4, so this is an anomaly when the bishop's on f4. So we have three distinct uh, variations on the dark side of this. So we get a6, and we don't want them to uh, stay there, attain that post, so we, we push them back. So we kind of gained, gained a little tempo for our progression there. So we play d6. a4 isn't all that great. So say they play a3, then we play uh, bishop here, and, and it's good for us. So... The only compromising move would be here, takes, 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 and then e6, and then uh, we play a8, and uh, analysis will show that uh, we have a slight pull in this position, even if they take the bishop, and we take um, pretty happy with the queen side play, and we're going to be moving our queen to like... Uh, certain square and we have our knight going to c7 and uh, attacking a b2 pawn is there so uh, it's, it's pretty good uh, for us even though they have the two bishop versus two knights uh, it's, a, it's a good good position so you can play queen d7 here um, you can play c4 which is also good I bet c4 is the best because when you can get away with that then do it and uh, we're, we're cooking up some uh, tricks here and uh, I got confidence in that position and that distinction uh, by the way was made after after the, the proper position which is this and that's bishop f4 the poison pawn we always go rook b8 but then there's three distinct times so Bishop f4 when they go for the poison pawn here, then we have to play uh, queen b6. And in the first video, I went over the other ones. They play rook e1, then here. And uh, oh, that, that was not what the why? Why? Bishop f4, uh, rook here was the first variation and then that's when we play here 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 and that's in the first video and then uh, another one is this and that's a that's a that's a whole different distinction here when they come in for this and that's in the first uh, video and that's not queen b6 that's just bishop here so there's three distinct uh, responses for uh, the, 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 the continuations, the following continuations, um, the continuations that follow when they go for that pawn. So you got, you got here, rook e1, you're always moving here, okay? And when they go in here, then we go, um, we go for the, the, the first what's elucidating video one and uh, and then when they go here we go here and when they go in for it then then we move here and the other distinction is um, when they move Bishop f4 which is this last video which I just covered and we move here and they go in for it then we actually don't even allow the poison pawn to be taken